Good morning, vlog. Uh, what's up with Canada lately? Okay, so you have the floods in Alberta, a train accident happened in Montreal, and last night Toronto got flooded. Like, a whole lot. I wasn't even fully aware of Alberta. I feel like when natural disasters happen to America or anywhere else in the effing world, you hear about it. But having something happen in Canada, I didn't even really hear about it. The floods in Alberta. But Toronto and Montreal, I heard about the train accident and the Toronto flood. It was just a rain. I don't know what the Alberta's was. I believe someone told me melting snow on top of the mountains. That just sounds silly. You know, but it's about time. Canada, bad stuff happened to them. I mean, we're an awesome country with great people. But why does bad stuff always have to happen to other people? I think Canada can take a few blows. That sounds really weird. You know what I mean. Look at China. Earthquakes, tsunamis. Nothing bad really happens in Canada, so it's, it's scary to know that stuff could happen in Canada. But at the same time, it, it's nice to know that for once it's not somewhere else. That makes sense? I'm not sure it does. Like I know natural disasters and stuff happen to Canada, but how often do you hear about it? Not a whole lot, right? I know in history we learned about the droughts and like, what year was that? Ages ago? Uh, the molasses flood, the flood in Port Hope, where I live. See, I can't name a whole lot. Crazy, right? No tornadoes, no earthquakes, no hurricanes, no tropical storms. There's nothing really for us up here. We just get the tail end of everything, and normally it's not that bad. So we're about to watch Harry Potter again because we just had a marathon. Hi, Cody. Are you on the phone? Yeah. Should I be quiet? Sure. Okay. Shh. It's important. It's the CIA. One down, seven more to go. Which one's your favorite? The last one. The last one. Yeah. Mine too. Just don't like how. Voldemort and Bellatrix died, man. Spoilers. Spicy? I said spoilers. Man, I'm sorry. Seriously? Shrinking and then exploding? No, that's stupid. Voldemort turning into dust? What the balls is that? It's stupid. Well, you got a lot of kids watching. Not that there's yeah. not other dead bodies just lying around. Yeah, there's a bit when there's just body. He's like, oh man, Voldemort, maybe not be dead. Oh, no, he's a pile of ashes. Let's breathe him in. <gasps> no. It's because his very soul is destroyed. Why in the book was he keep flaking away? And why did Bellatrix shrink to death? Like, she went anorexic and that exploded. I don't recall that. You don't recall that? Well, no. you'll see in the last movie. All aboard the Hogwarts Express! Press. Next stop, Azkaban! I totally did steal that from Yes Man. Ugh. Cucumber was thrown at me. Flicked. Flicked. A cucumber was th flicked at me. We're on movie three, man. It's only what time is it? Middle after six. So, almost seven. Oh, we're gonna be up all night. Remember, we'll try to watch them all. Yeah, well, that. that it was like end five well. in the morning. Well, we're on I the fourth got... one. Distracted and, and, and we were laughing the balls off because we make making jokes about it. And dad came downstairs and he's like, Don't you have to work in three hours? Oh, that's one of you told me when everyone was here, but yeah, I remember that. Yeah, this should be a week to you. I'm here to spoil for my. And it's like, Yeah, man, we're almost done. Yeah, we're only on the fourth one. Yeah, back then I was almost done, they didn't have all the note yet. 
Trinity, there was still six, in seven part one, and five. Yeah, there was three more movies. Yeah. We would have finished when you got home from work. Would you, no, we didn't, because we had to leave right when I got home from work, because you start the second part of the seventh one, and you only got one Harry's like, hey, we should leave, and then Ron's like, don't tell Hermione that I said we need her. What you playing? I don't know, it's called Dylan. It's called Badland. Okay, well, why don't you ask if you know what it is? I don't know. Are you enjoying it? <gasps> you just beat the level! Fantastic. You're halfway done, World 1. About there. <gasps> Did you know that? Yeah. Alright, so we're watching Harry Potter, obviously. Uh, so I just had this awesome idea. That could have stopped everything. Okay, so when you're a wizard, I don't know if it's when you're born or when you turn 11, but until you're 17, you have this trace on you, right? And it and it allows the government to know what spell you use, who you use, who you used it on, what you used it on, when you know where you used it, everything about that spell. And I think that's a good idea. That's an awesome idea. And I think if they extended that for your whole life. I think crime would go down, and if there was a crime, imagine how easy it would be to get someone arrested. Oh, use that spell on that person, that like, could have saved a lot of time. Saved a lot of people who were wrongly accused. It's just a good idea, but it's kind of like government wanting to have access to your cell phone and your computer. There's a privacy issue and I get it, but it's a good idea for the wizarding world to do. Oh, Voldemort, you killed a guy. Tom Riddle, you killed a guy. You're only 16. Come with us. Hey, he killed someone. He used some Man, now I'm confused, because he did kill when he was in school. Why don't they know about that? Did he use someone else's wand? I don't think that's how it works, though. Hmm. Is that a plot hole that was never filled? Huh. Time for another one. Indeed. Oh, Indeed. Disc back. man. What? Get the disc man. Shush, man. Number four man. I like this one, but the hair's a wee bit too long. And I hate when everyone operates and the campfire's all burnt down and it looks like a riot happened. And he goes, You're at the scene of the crime! And Harry's like, Crime? What crime? <laughs> You're a moron, Harry, sometimes. Just look around, man. Just take one, <laughs> one glance in right where you're looking right now. <laughs> You can discover that the seal of God. Crime? Barty, they're just kids. What crime? We're halfway done, Cody. No, oh, Lord. Only halfway. Technically. Four, four more to go. Harry Potter's four sevens of the way done. Why? Because the last two's only one year, you tit. Yeah, but there's four more movies. Yeah, there's eight movies, but we're four of the seven years in. Alright. Yeah. Did you put the right one in? No, I put in the eighth one. Just skip ahead. Good job. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> I'm only joking. You don't want to defeat it. I got you. <laughs> you got me. Three more, Cody. Come on, three more. You're in charge of the disc change. I'm in charge of the disc change now. Yeah. But the balls, all day it's been you. I'm mid level. Last three, it's Cody. There's a pause button, and if you die, you return near where you Billy, were. I don't care. Where is the buttons on this thing? The front side. I found them. We're going into the pensive. Tell them what you just did. Well, it was four in the morning. Okay. I figured we'll save the last two for tomorrow. I thought we were going to watch them all today. Well, guess what? What? You didn't even want to watch them at first, so shut up. So I guess good night then. Bye. Good night. Four in the morning. <laughs>